All right, Dan, here's your 2006 six-speed uh, 350Z Nissan Cluster uh, with your silver uh, gauge face on it. I, I uh, took a stock one and put all blue LEDs and uh, red for your needles, a white shift light, and now I'll go out and uh, put some needles on it in the car. All right? All right, Dan, your real cool silver gauge is about to come to life. Let me shut the door. I've got blue interior lights, but it's silver, and it's a cool silver because it matches all the silver trim in your Z. And of course, they're all black at night. Now I have the shift light set at 2,000, and it's extremely bright because this is one of the newer models that uh, Alec Black Cat has made for me that has a larger, uh, clearer area around the needle. It's uh, 0.064 instead of 0.060 centimeters in diameter. So I'll still need to set the mileage to match your car and I still need to put it in a case and I need to make uh, your little side lights in blue as well. Uh, but I just had it on the freeway, set the mile an hour. It's a really nice looking cluster. I'm going to tell you, every time I do one of these blue and reds, I think, why do I not have that in my car? And your shift light is uh, ultra, ultra bright. There's only four or five that have this really bright one like this. Anyway, back to work. All right, Dan, I have this thing completed and put together. And it all is in ship shape. It all is ship shape as a sailor might say and uh, let's see even have your little side lights in blue yeah. now the uh, uh, seat belt check engine all that stuff uh, airbag that's all just my car your car won't have that stuff blinking I'll show you how to set the shift light it's set to uh, like 2000 or something. Come over here. Uh, let me dim dim down the lights. Maybe we can see it. Stand by. Let me uh, close the aperture down the camera. Okay, if you can see that, just take your top button over here on the uh, right hand side and scroll around. Uh, Till you get to uh, your RPM, which is after your tire monitors, right before uh, miles an hour, push the bottom button, and and it will scroll up by 500 if you hold it. You can press them individually, uh, and you can set your shift light to come on any anywhere you want. This goes up to 8,000. I usually kind of keep it low around here. It's three after three in the morning, and on Christmas night, everybody's asleep. But, so that's how you set it uh, and I'm going to start your center cluster now it sure looks good man it is uh, really nice looking so alright alright Dan get the center section done it's looking good bro and uh, it's not in my cluster I have my cluster taken out my center waterfall cluster taken out and uh, close the or get the blue lights off of it. Oh yeah. Put my headlights on so we can dim this down of course if we want. Uh, brighten it up. Uh, and it's got uh, your tire monitors on there. Uh, there they are right there. And you press the bottom button to get to the rear, rear and front. And there's where you set your uh, shift uh, needle. Uh, let me get it down where it's reasonable. It's like 4.30 in the morning now. Uh, but your cluster sure looks nice, man. Sure does. So, I'll express mail this uh, for you. I'll send you an email with a link to pay. And uh, we'll express mail it. And you'll have it uh, tomorrow. All right then, dude. It's a really nice looking. Oh, and and you'll be. Uh, 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 I'll have to take the back of this off to set the mileage. This one has twelve thousand, so you, you'll have to tell me your mileage on this on my shopping cart. But uh, it's a nice looking gauge set. Oh, and if you dim these down, you can dim these down with the left hand. 
uh, the shift light's really bright. See, a lot more contrast than, than if they're up all the way. All right, I'll upload this to YouTube for it, dude.